Hello everybody, Floppy Hat Photos back here for another amazing adventures of the Almighty Bruce. And today is Monday the 23rd, and today was an absolutely gorgeous weather-wise day, um, beautiful out. And tonight, or today I actually picked up my dog finally. He spent the night at the people I got him from his house. They ended up watching him for me. My father was dying of cancer and stuff, had a really, really rough evening yesterday evening. I was able to call them, they came and got him and dropped him and picked him up for me. Took him home. They didn't keep him overnight. They had him most of the day. I thought they were going to have him again tonight because my father was still just barely holding on to life. And my father passed today at um, 6 minutes till 4, so 3.54 p.m. Um, and I just, I got that settled. I had a bunch of hassles. My brother was being a dick when they were fighting with the stepson, fighting with everybody about the body and whatnot. And it was just a pain in the ass. So I went ahead and said to hell with it, and I went and got my dog. I was missing my dog. I really wanted to talk to him, really wanted to see him, really wanted to hug him. So I was able to go get him. I was so happy to get him. He went back out to care center with me. He's kind of been hanging around. He sensed that I'm really sad, I think, tonight. He's been really clingy, really needy. Plus, he was with them all day, and when he misses me like that, he definitely usually ends up kind of being a little clingy, too. So I'm not sure if it's just him being clingy or if it's actually him knowing that I'm kind of not really in the best of the mood and the stress and whatnot of dealing with my brother and stepson wanting to argue and fight with everybody and just wanting to sue people and all kinds of crazy ass shit it means nothing about nothing so but today I gotta say the dog really impressed me he kicked butt today he did absolutely awesome Let me go ahead and see down here if we can't get this where you can see him down here he's all napping he just looks all sad and just so just depressed doesn't he such a poor dog never never had any love at all have you just so abused but that right there is basically him and he's just laying down the um Foot of the bed right there, waiting for me to get in, get undressed, and get into bed, and get ready for that, so you can jump up there and kind of keep my feet warm, I guess. So, super proud of the guy. Um, I got back to see him. I hadn't seen him, like I said, and you know, I don't know, near in the 24-hour range, not quite, probably 20 hours, and he was just crazy. And I kind of warned the person that came with me to go pick him up, I'm like I'm gonna beat the crap out of that dog. We're gonna rough house. We're gonna play and all that, and we definitely did that. So. He was awesome the whole time with my dad in the process of dying and all that stuff too. So I'm super proud of him. And if you guys ever get your chance to get out and have yourself an adopted dog, always be willing to provide a better life for some animal or person. You'll never regret it one day of your life. Thank you for watching and I'll talk to you guys soon. Have a great, wonderful day.